Hi, it's Dwyer, gamblersadvisory.com, DwyerVIP.com. Remember, the opinion you should follow should be your own. Just consider this video to be a second opinion from a complete stranger online. Let's talk NCAA futures before this tournament gets underway. I only like two teams on the futures, right? I believe futures are the way to play things. You can hedge bets later. But just consider yourself lucky to get Kentucky here at a plus 120, right? Understand Kentucky is an elite team defensively. What do I mean by that? I mean in 34 games, Kentucky had 223 steals. More importantly, and this is where teams like Arizona cannot match Kentucky. In 34 games, Kentucky had 234 block shots. Let me repeat that. 34 games, 234 block shots. Now, Arizona can hang on steals. In 34 games, Arizona had 224 steals. But even a team with length like Kentucky can't match them in block shots. In 34 games, Arizona had 122 blocks. Right? Let me repeat that. 34 games, 122 blocks. In other words, Kentucky had, in the same number of games, more than 100 more blocks than the Arizona Wildcats. Now, why am I mentioning Arizona and not Duke and not North Carolina and not Villanova? It's because I feel right now the two teams that are the two best in this tournament are Kentucky and the Arizona Wildcats. Let me point out, everyone knows about John Calipari, excellent coach, one of those rare college coaches with pro experience, and that matters. Well, understand, Arizona has an excellent coach in Sean Miller. He's one of the very best in the country, right? So, at this stage, and we should feel grateful that Kentucky's such a huge favorite. At this stage, you're getting a plus 120 on Kentucky. Understand, though, because Kentucky's such a dominant favorite, you're getting huge odds on everyone else, including quality teams like Arizona. You're getting 7-1 to one on Arizona. So, today, March 17, 2015, the way I'm playing the 2015 NCAA tournament is I'm putting futures actions, right? I'm taking the futures on the Kentucky Wildcats, the best defensive team in the country, right? And I'm also putting futures action on the Arizona Wildcats. Keep in mind, you don't have to put the same amount on each, especially since you're getting huge seven to one odds on Arizona. Understand both of these teams are elite defensive teams. Both of these teams played very difficult schedules. I would encourage you to look up the teams on the Jeff Sagarin ratings and the Ken Pomeroy ratings here online. Okay, so you have teams with size, Teams with great defense, teams with great records, playing great opposition. I think these are the two teams to look at. Kentucky, right, the obvious market choice, and Arizona, the Pac-12 champion. Let me hear from you. I'm sure we all have a lot of different advice to give, right? I'm sure depending on what part of the country you're in, there's certain teams that you feel are well prepared for the NCAA. So, to the Notre Dame people, right? To the Duke people, to North Carolina, to Villanova, to all of these teams that are highly ranked, who you feel represent value, fan bases, tell us about each. Tell us why the gamblers here online need to give the team you like a look. Please do so in the comment section to this video. Thanks for stopping by.